What's good, guys? If you want cheap, fast, and reliable NBA 2K20 My Team coins, head on over to NBAsafe.com and use code BUGS for 5% off at checkout. What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Bugs back on another NBA 2K20 My Team video. And guys, today we do have some new spotlight content. It looks like we got a Hakeem, we got a ton of new players, and it is for a pink nine Richard Jefferson. As per usual, drop 20,000 in the comments, like the video, sub if you're new, for a chance of winning 20,000 MT. And yeah, guys, in this video, we're going to go over the new content, all that good stuff. And yeah, we do have the new spotlight challenges. So honestly, I don't really like this content at all. But so um, if you do complete the spotlight challenge, you do get a pink diamond Richard Jefferson. And we're going to go over all the stats in this video. So um. We're going to start off with the Pink Diamond Richard Jefferson stats. So, to complete the Spotlight Challenge, you do get a uh, 97 Pink Diamond Richard Jefferson, 93 3, 92 mid range. He's got a dunk of a 98, standing dunk of an 85, uh, a post fade of an 82, playmaking 86, speed 95. He's a 95 speed, 88 speed with ball, so he's not that fast. He's got a 98 vert. He's got defending. He's got an 88 perimeter, which is terrible for a pink diamond 97 and a block 78. Uh, interior D84, 92 steel. Ah, uh, he's all right. Rebounding 78, 82. Ah, uh, he's all right. Honestly, I'm not doing that spotlight challenge. I could care less. To be honest, big waste of time. Um, if you guys don't know, um, there is... So if you guys don't know, these packs are, it's a Jason Kidd Spotlight Challenge, but it is for, what's it called? It's for Jason Kidd, so, I mean, it's not for Jason Kidd, it's for, um, yeah, it's for Jason Kidd and the Richard Jefferson is at the end, so you get to Evo the Jason Kidd. Um, just waiting for more stats to pop up, but right now we do have the Richard Jefferson. I think most of the stuff is going to pop up at a 1 o'clock. We do have the whole cards. We have every single card in the set that I will show you. And here we go. No, that's that's definitely not it. Here it is. So, Hakeem, probably a pink diamond. Uh, Jay Terry, Vince Carter. Vince Carter, they just dropped the... They have to have a diamond, right? Kenyon Martin, McDyess, Jim Jackson. Did they really just drop another penny that's terrible? This collection is terrible. Uh, I just wish I could see. So, it's probably going to be a pink diamond, a Pink diamond, 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 at least a diamond. Kenyon Martin's definitely a diamond. I don't know. We'll see. Hopefully they drop the stats soon. I'll be right back with you. Alrighty, so um there is a Evo Kmart, Kenyon Martin. He is an amethyst. 92 overall. I don't have the stats yet, but he is a two-star Evo. So we probably go up to pink diamond. Vince and Jason Terry are diamonds. Hakeem is a pink diamond. So we will be right back with you with the stats. So far, I guess this set's pretty decent. Market crash could happen. We're going to go over the market a little bit. But yeah, be right back with you. Alrighty, guys. So we do have the pink diamond Hakeem. It's a 97 overall. He has a 78-3, 92 mid-range, uh, 98 offensive, 95 standing dunk, 75 driving, post fade 97, post hook 98, uh, 79 speed, 85 vert, 95 strength. Bro. Block 95, interior D is a 98, rebounding 95, 98. Oh my god. He has gold quick draw. That's enough said. He has a ton of Hall of Fame badges. This Hakeem is fire, bro. So we got a 97 Hakeem. The Vince Carter is a 94. The Antonio McDyess is a 91 Evo. And the 92 Kenyon Martin is an Evo. Um, so let's see. Um, Let's go over the Vince Carter stats. Here we go. So we got a Vince Carter, 90 mid-range, 93, okay? So we got a 97 dunk, a 95 layup, 79 post fade, 94 speed, uh, 98 vertical, perimeter D, 89, steel, 82, decent defense. He is only a 94 diamond. I don't know why they just, why they only give him a 94. So a 94 gold quick draw. Cash and Shoot uh, Hall of Fame, Raging Center Hall of Fame, Volume Shooter Hall of Fame, Lob City Finisher, Contact Finisher, Showtime, Fast Break Finisher, Hall of Fame, Relentless Finisher Gold, Consistent Finisher Gold. So, 
Honestly, this Govins Carter is pretty filthy, not gonna lie. I kind of like this card. It's only a 94, definitely could be better, but I'm honestly hyped to see it. Now, the Jason Terry's Diamond. Um, His defense has got to be terrible. Actually, it's an 88 perimeter, 88 steal, so that's not bad. So we got 95 three-pointer, 97 mid-range for Jason Terry, 95 free throw. Um, He's got... Close shot 96, 96 layup, 94 foul. He's got playmaking 95, pass accuracy 95, pass IQ 94, athleticism 98 speed, 98 speed of ball, vertical 98. Wait a second, can Jason Terry dunk? No, he can't. I don't know why he's a 98 vert then. 98 stamina, perimeter D 88, steel 88, lateral quickness 90, uh, defensive consistency 85. Let's check out the badges, bro. He might have some crazy, crazy badges. Let's see. Shooting. Catch and shoot. Raging Sender at uh, Hall of Fame. Quick draw goal. Green Machine goal. Catch and shoot at uh, Hall of Fame. Clutch shooter Hall of Fame. Surreal ball Hall of Fame. Dimer Hall of Fame. Quick first step Hall of Fame. Acrobat Hall of Fame. John Slayer. Slithery. Teardrop. All Hall of Fame. So, I would say this card's pretty good as well. There's so many cards. Kenyon Martin Evo. Uh, at base, he's got a 79-3, an 85 mid, a 70 dunk. I can't even imagine this car fully upgraded. 74 speed, 82 block, 82 interior, 78 perimeter, 74 steel, 93, 94 rebounding. So with this card all the way upgraded to a pink diamond, I can't even imagine the stats. He's probably so good. Probably one of the best pink diamond. Pick down power forwards in the game, yo. Like, literally, those Amethyst stats are really good. He's got gold quick draw out of Amethyst, too. So, interesting stuff. I'm definitely going to try to get this card when he's a pink diamond because that card is stacked. Um, Ken Ward was always good. So, we got PJ Brown Amethyst. I didn't even know PJ Brown was in the set. So, it's a center PJ, PJ Brown center on the Hornets. Uh, he's got 26 three. He's got an 80 mid range. So, can shoot. Uh, he is seven one. Uh, he's got a post fade at 78, a post logo 83, standing duck 95, 79. Uh, driving. All right, speed 63. Help defense IQ 94. Interior D 94. Uh, block 95, offensive rebounding 93, 94. All right, PJ Brown 92. That's him, if you can see. Uh, nothing special with him. Antonio McDyer, let's see. He's got an Evo, it's a 92 car, 91 overall. I mean, Evo to a diamond, probably like a 94, 93 diamond. But uh, let's see what we got here. What, why is it lagging? Why is it lagging? Hold on one second. Damn, the Hakeem, though? The Hakeem, though, is actually one of the most filthiest cards in the game. In the game. Now, where's the Jason Kidd? That's what I'm looking for. So, the Jason Kidd is a Sapphire, evolvable to it looks like a Galaxy Opal, but it's probably not. Ruby, Ami, Diamond, Pink Diamond, yeah, nah. Probably to a pink diamond. I don't know. I wish it could show all the stats, but uh, yeah, he's probably available to a pink diamond So we got a Ton of content. We got the Antonio McDyess. This set could be a lot of money, bro 89 mid this is on the amethyst not overall 80 dunk 90 uh, 80 driving 95 standing post fade 90 90 post hook interior 85 perimeter at 46 so he's all interior. Uh, his blocks is 69. He's terrible. This card's terrible. Maybe he's better upgraded, but uh, this card pretty much looks like a giant waste. And he has gold quick draw. I don't know why every card is gold quick draw. Sean Kemp Ruby. Don't know why they released this. 90 dunk, 90 standing. I'm not even going to read you. So they have a Ruby Sean Kemp, a Hot Rod Williams Ruby, power forward slash center. He has a 25-3, so he's useless. <laughs> 80 dunk, 95 standing. Alright, so really no one cares about that. We got hot Kerry Kittles. He's got 87-3. I don't really want to go over these cars because they're terrible. So we got the rest is a Ruby Kenny Kittles. We got a Keith Van Horn Evo Ruby. 
We got a Jason Kidd Evo. We got a Rex Chapman Sapphire, which is going to be a budget baller. We got a a Todd Mac Cole coach. I don't know. Um, he's terrible. So no really. So this these sets are terrible. And we got a Penny Hardaway Sapphire. I don't know. Two K's wax. So yeah, that is the. St those are the cards. The packs are still not here, but I'm the first person in the world to post the content. So make sure to drop that like. Um, personally, I think this is this this, this is this so stupid. This content, in my opinion, you could disagree, but personally, I'm not even touching this set. I don't even want to buy a player in the set besides the Vince Carter. And if I could buy a Kenyon Martin, pick Diamond, and obviously the Akeem, but this set. I would not probably probably not touching the spotlight set for Richard Jefferson or Jason Kidd. Personally, terrible, terrible. Nothing I really care about. It's up to you guys though. Uh, let me know what you guys think about the content. Also, like the video if you're new. Hope you guys enjoyed. 20,000 MT in the comments. Peace.